welcome to my program, 10 Minutes with Riban. My name is Riban, and today we're going to be doing Algebra Part 2. So, why do we start this test? Let's go! So, we're doing test 2 today. Question 1. Fill in the boxes with the num numbers missing from these calculations. Well, 1a, 8 plus 2 equals 10, but that's not the answer here, which is something, take away 3. Well, if we want to find that something, we need to add 10 to 3, because you're taking away to get 10. 10 plus 3 is 13. B. 12 take away equals 4 plus 5. 4 plus 5 is 9, so 12 take away 3 equals 9, 2. Question, not question C, just C. 24 divided by 6, which is 4, equals something times 2. Well, 24 plus 6 equals, no, 24 divided by 6 equals 4. So that means 2 times 2 will equal 4. D. Something plus 2 equals 3 times 7. 3 times 7 is 21. So, 21 take away 2 will give us 19. Not 90, 19. Question 2. When P equals 2, what is the value of P plus 5? Substitute P with 2. 2 plus 5 is... Seven. Keep doing that with the rest of the piece, and then solve the equation. So B P take away three, which is two take away three, negative one. Four times P, which is also four times two, is eight. And finally, P divided by two or two divided by two is one. Question three. Rohan has M stickers. Sarah has eight fewer stickers than Rohan. Circle the expression for the numbers of stickers that Sarah has. If she has, if Sarah has eight fewer, that means M take away eight. This is what we need to circle. Question four: The five extra expressions below should all equal fifteen. Draw lines to. Join them, join each of them to the value of n which makes this happen. Okay. So, all of these expressions should all equal 15. So, let's start from n plus 9. If we need 15, it will be 6. Nineteen take away n, that'll be four. Forty five divided by n, that'll be three. Because forty five divided by three is fifteen. Three times n, that'll be five. And the last one, 
is the last one. Question 5. A group of n octopuses have a total of 8 n tentacles. How many tentacles do 6 octopuses have altogether? Well, we need to use this formula, a n. Just substitute n for 6. 8 times when a letter is next to a number with no space, then you'll have to times it. 6 times 8 will be 48. So, six octopuses have 48 tentacles. Six. Question six. Fiona has thrown three darts at the board on the right. The outer ring scores three points. The middle ring scores seven points. And the centre scores X points. We don't know the X. Fiona scored a total of 15 points. Work out the value of X. Look where she hit them. One in the outer ring, one in the middle, one in the centre. She had 15 points and 7 plus 3 is 10. So take away 10 from 15, you'll leave 5. That means she hit one more and that'll be 5. So X will be 5. Question mate. Oh, Leroy threw three darts and scored X plus 14 points. Exactly one dart landed in the centre circle. Where did the other two darts land? Tick your answer. X will be 5. So, take away 5 from here. Or just take away. She'll have 14 points left. 14 points. Just, she... Had her arrows on 7, because 7 times 2 is 14. Wait. Both in the middle ring. Yes, that's correct. Yeah. So, let's review what we have done. Let me just check here. Yeah. So, test two, question one. Fill in the boxes with the numbers missing from these calculations. If us two. Ten. Thirteen to ten, yeah. Four. Okay. 12, take away 9 is 3. No. Yeah, I need to change that. 12, take away 3 is 9. 4, take away 5, yes. 19 plus 2, yeah. 7. 8. Negative 1. Negative. Just 1, yeah. As I said, substitute the P for 2. Question 3. Yeah, I should have explained it. So, the explanation for question 3. If Rohan has M stickers, so, and so has 8 fewer, M would be taken away by 8, since so has 8 fewer stickers than Rohan. M is how many Rohan has, and... Take away A will give you Sarah's. Question 4. Let me check. This. Yep. That'll give 15. 13 plus 2. Yep. Yeah. If I know it. 15, 30, 45. Yeah. And then last one. Yeah. Group of n. 8 times 6 is 48 since there's 6 octopuses. In question 5, there are 6 octopuses, so 8 times 6 will be 48. Alright, so 
I forgot to explain number six too. I'm just so when you're trying to explain this, you'll have to do so. We know that her darts landed one in the outer ring, so OT is outer ring. No, OR's outer ring. Middle ring is MR. And center ring is CR. So she hit one each. The center ring is X. We don't know how many points that is. So outer ring and middle ring have one each. That means 7 plus 3 is 10. We already have 10 points. Oh, yeah. Just need to separate, stretch. Okay, since here she has 7 plus 3, which is 10 points, X will be something, and she hit 1 there. 15 take away 10 is 5. So that means... X is 5 points. That's how you explain it. Outer ring, middle ring, center ring. Couldn't write it long because then it would merge in with this sentence. Leroy threw 3 dots. Then she, he got X. X is 5. So take away X. You've got 14 points left. So he threw 3, that x is 1, so now he has 2, which is 14. 14, he can make 2 7s, so fourteen could be split or divided in 7s. which will give us two and he had two dots left so wait let me switch that around so yeah he's now got a seven which is here so both in the middle ring yeah i hope you have enjoyed this test exam and learnt at least one thing from it Learn every day for a minimum of just 10 minutes. And I'll see you all next weekend. Bye!